Hey everyone, this is Mike coming at you from Michael Bar Chevrolet here in Pickering, Kingston Road and Whites. Coming at you with a 2011 Cadillac CTS. This car is equipped with a 3 liter V6 engine that is all wheel drive. This car is fantastic. Uh, it drives exceptionally well in the wet, in the rain, uh, snow, on, on beautiful days. This car performs. The engine is just immaculate. Uh, with the 3 liter V6, it also is standard with a 6 uh, speed automatic transmission with the 17 inch aluminum painted rims um, that have the uh, 17 inch uh, all season tires as well. We also have a tire pressure monitor and Bluetooth for your phone. Um, the interior is uh, the interior is where it's definitely at. The exterior looks amazing. So let's go now and look at the inside. And here we are inside the CTS, and as you can see, we have lovely luxury uh, seating and luxury handles and luxury everything. This car screams performance and it screams luxury and quality. Um, I'll give you more of a hands-on approach, so don't mind my feet in this video. Uh, but I'm just going to give you more of a hands-on approach to most of the features in the vehicle. So start on our left, uh, we have nice soft leather touch uh, on the handles and our and. Uh, Basically, this is like where uh, where I like my arms to sit right here, and I think it's a perfect height, it's perfect comfort level. I uh, absolutely love it. Uh, we have this nice carbon fiber looking uh, trim finish here um, with these nice chrome handles. We also have the seat memory seats uh, right here, so all we have to do is set our seats to whatever it is we'd like uh, that are powered. Pull down one of the one or the two buttons. Um, it'll beep and then when you push it the next time someone's fiddling with your seat it'll go exactly where you had a set before. We also have uh, powered mirrors, power windows and power locks with child safety locks and windows as well. There's our parking brake. Uh, we have a lovely leather wrapped steering wheel that has our uh, cruise control volume uh, uh, voice commands, pretty much uh, all those features right there on the steering wheel, very accessible. Nice racing style uh, steering wheel as well, very responsive. Um, in the middle, where we have our speedometer right to the right of our uh, RPM meter, we have our driver information center. So on the left here, uh, we can push one of these buttons and it'll actually control uh, our driver information center. So we have our fuel range, average economy, our timer. Uh, pretty much anything we could think of. There's our digital speedometer um, and then we also have different settings as well like our tire pressure monitor, etc. So uh, the car gives you uh, digital feedback uh, on what the car is actually doing, how it's performing, uh, when you need to basically fill up and when you need to get it checked. So very handy, very easy. Uh, oops, excuse me. Uh, when we uh, work our way to the middle uh, you can see that we have our uh, radio that has AM, FM, and XM radio. Uh, as you can see, we have an FM, AM, and XM button right here. So we don't actually have to go fidgeting through where our XM radio is. There's a button exclusively for it, uh, which is, I think, extremely handy. Um, we have uh, nice chrome accents um, over the buttons and over the vents and over the steering wheel and over the handles. Um, gives it a, a lovely, lovely touch. Uh, we also have heated seats on both sides um, that we can also uh, change the intensity to. So if we want it really hot, uh, we can set it all the way and uh, all the way down until we turn it off. Uh, we have dual climate control, so both driver and passenger can actually experience different uh, temperatures in the same car. So if one person wants it a little bit warmer, one person wants it a little bit cooler, they can set it to whatever it is they like. Um, and then controlling the fans and such right there um, on the dash. We also have air conditioning and uh, front and rear defrost like you would uh, in any other Cadillac. Uh, we also have our CD button, auxiliary button. The auxiliary is actually located just under here. Uh, you can see that's where our auxiliary is in a 12 volt outlet as well. And then another storage compartment uh, just underneath uh, here as well. Um, so yeah, so lots of storage space. Um, and then we also have, uh, the, oh, and this one as well. We can put our wallet, our keys, pretty much anything we'd like in there as well. So we have two storage compartments right in here. Uh, very nice leather in here. A very nice, uh, smooth, metallic finish um, for our cup holders. Uh, this is just a very nice, uh, a very nice finish to the car. It feels very smooth, uh, good to look at too. Um, we also have our CD player just underneath that. 
And then one thing I really like about this vehicle, and, and it's very familiar to any Cadillac owners already, is that uh, analog clock right in the middle. I think that's a, a phenomenal um, touch to the luxury and the simplicity of this vehicle. Uh, I love the simple face to the clock. You can set it however you want. Um, I think it's a very, very nice touch. I think uh, it should stick around for a while. And if you like things like that, this is a perfect accessory for this vehicle. We also have a nice deep glove, uh, glove box, and we also have uh, power windows and power locks on our passenger side as well. Um, and then we also have our Bose uh, surround sound speaker system, which is uh, which sounds incredible. A uh, good thing about the Bose speaker system is that when you turn it up, um, you can turn it up as loud as you want, and the volume will actually cut out. Um, basically, will only go any higher once it starts experiencing any crackling. So. Um, good old handy bows down at Bose coming up with that ingenuity um, so you never really blow a speaker ever in this car so listen to it as loud as you want until it gets crackly in, a, uh, in your tone settings you can change it around a bit um, but no matter what tone settings you have or CD auxiliary or even radio station because different radio stations have different frequencies uh, and tones to their music uh, just like are different than a CD or auxiliary would um, so the Bose actually modifies the frequencies and then cuts out whenever there's any unnecessary crackling. So really good touch. I mean, I, I think sound's important. I think comfort's important, obviously, and the driving experience is immaculate. Uh, and all these things add up to one amazing driving experience. So that's the front. Let's go check out the back. And as we head to the back of the CTS, you can see that we have our uh, passenger vents back here uh, that will keep us cool in the... Uh, in the summer and warm in the winter. We also have lovely premium leather seats in the back, uh, enough space, uh, uh, well, passenger space for three passengers uh, with a full length seat belt in the middle. If you've seen any other videos, um, I'm a big, uh, I'm a big fan of the uh, third passenger seat belt that goes from collarbone to hip uh, very securely, so you're never sacrificing uh, any safety for your third passenger. Uh, if you have the uh, two passengers, we also have a fold-down armrest with cup holders, and we also have rear cargo mats, rubber cargo mats in the back as well. There is lots of leg room. It is very luxurious back here. Uh, I'm about 5'11", 6 feet tall, and I have um, a, enough headroom back there, uh, more than enough headroom, uh, and a very, very decent amount, very generous amount of leg room as well. Um, so not only is it very safe, it also sounds very good because the, the, the Bose speaker system, it's incredibly comfort, so anyone who's doing long commutes, it's definitely going to be comfortable, and uh, your legs are never going to be cramping, I promise. When we come to the back, just lift up the latch here, uh, we have a cargo net back here, so it keeps any uh, belongings, uh, such as uh, groceries or anything like that, very safely secure in there. We can also remove that, it's not a problem. Uh, the seats also uh, in the back actually fold down, so if you need something to put anything longer in there, you can do so. There is a lot of storage back here, uh, so you can put definitely a large amount of groceries, gym bags, hockey bags, uh, and anything longer like a golf bag. You can definitely do so in this vehicle. Nothing looks better than showing up to a golf tournament or a golf practice there. Your buddy is driving up in one of these, that's for sure. This car is definitely worth the attention. Um, so all in all, uh, lots of storage space, lots of cargo space, very comfortable for the driver and also the passengers. And that concludes our quick walk around presentation of the Cadillac CTS. Uh, if I've missed anything or if you have any questions, please feel free to ask them in the comment section or even just come into the dealership and talk to one of our representatives. Um, and come for a test drive. This car is definitely a car you need to drive. Um, the specs on the car, um, I mean, you can get anywhere, but I mean, actually sitting down and driving it, uh, I mean, test drives are free, and we, we're always more than happy to let to let anyone coming in who, who's looking at to buy a Cadillac to sit in the driver's seat and taking it for uh, taking it for a drive. So definitely come on down to Michael Borer Chevrolet here in Kingston or here in uh, Pickering. Kingston Road and Whites, and come test drive one of your very own Cadillac CTS. See you soon, guys. Take care.